So we're beginning to know Jamie Ivey, just as we've been getting to know all of our finalists, the contestants, if you will, for the new job of morning show co-host, the KVET Casting Call. We're with uh, Jamie Ivey. Jamie, what is your musical taste? Now, we, we've uncovered in learning about you that your your husband is a musical director at a church and is in a, I guess, be fair to say, a contemporary Christian band. Yeah, it's kind of rock and roll. So i got to believe you like that. I do. I do. I like that. I listen. I'm a pretty... I have a pretty broad listening. Uh, Country-wise, I grew up in Houston, going to the Houston Rodeo. Clay Walker, George Strait, Reba, Brooks and Dunn. So those kind of last with me a long time. I like the older stuff by them a lot. But I like Coldplay. I like, there's some local Austin bands that we always go out and see. Like Dave, who? Dave Ramirez, Matt McCloskey, Courier. You know, we like to go support them as well. Friends of Aaron's, and we like their music. How about this burgeoning Texas music scene with, you know, some of the, the guys and the women that we play. Are you familiar with that? I'm familiar. I've been to an Eli Young concert. Eli Young, opening up the rodeo. Going to be yes. on the program tomorrow. Yes. Not him, because there is no him. Right. There is no Eli Young. Mike Eli and his brother, but there is an Eli, but no. No Young. I think there is a Young. That's the other guy in the band. Oh. You'll talk to him. John Young. That's who it is? Yeah. Tomorrow. So you like them? I do. I went. We have a friend that works with them, and so I went to a concert of theirs and got to stand backstage, and that was a lot of fun. Um, Zach Brown Band, you know, I like them. I like a lot of the old, I guess I just grew up listening to the older, well, it's not older, because it was in the 90s when I was in high school, but, you oh, know. I hear you say that. Yeah, thanks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, you have an iPod, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. I mean, good Lord, I've got an iPod with thousands of songs. Mac Brown has an iPod. I'm sure you have an iPod. What's on the iPod? I've got a lot. I've got a lot of stuff from Black Eyed. I like Black Eyed Peas. So when I'm running, working out. Oh, and cornbread. Good Lord, lady. <laughs> Love them. Gold. Yes. Uh huh. Yeah, I bet they're on your iPod too, aren't they? Actually, I think one song, and I can't even remember what it is right now. But yeah, there's there was a Black Eyed Peas song that I really liked. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But the, I don't I don't know much about them. I like running to them. I mean, you know, it keeps me going. Uh, my kids actually are really digging Michael Jackson lately. We have introduced them to him. Really? It could it could go good or bad. We're not sure. <laughs> yeah, actually, my number one parenting mistake ever so far has been showing them the Thriller video. Have you seen it? Sure. What, what, why was that a parenting mistake? There's monsters in it, and he practically like they chase oh, them it, around. It bothered them. Yeah, they had nightmares. Uh, that was a bad move on our part. Nah, maybe not. Because uh, you know we kind of sheltered our kids, and I'll tell you, my daughter, who's I'm sure listening right now, I mean, uh, she doesn't. She won't watch a scary movie now if there's nobody else in the house. Uh, because she you never showed her one? Is that all? Well, right. You yeah. know, I mean, I think, uh, you know, we always said as, as parents, oh, they'll have nightmares, don't let them. Yeah, we should have overdosed them on that stuff. So I did a good thing. I think so. Okay, good. I think so. I think you'll find in time. Okay, I hope so. You did the thing. I hope so. Of course, you know, if your child turns out to be a mass murderer and uh, it all and goes all, back then, to that. Then we'll, we'll, po we'll point to this very moment, I that suspect. That is it, yeah. Could be. Yeah. God forbid. Well, the clock is just about ticked off, Jim. It's been fun. The other way around. It's a delight to have sat here with you uh, since about 7 o'clock this morning. Listeners that want to know what Jamie looks like and learn more about her can either go to the Bob Cole page at KVA.com or, once again, the Precision Camera and Video page. Because of these good folks, we've had a sneak peek at, uh, at all the, uh, the finalists, including videos and pictures. Learn more about Jamie this morning by checking out there. And, Jamie... Uh, I think we're going to hear from all of our finalists again sometime next week, so we'll look forward to that. I look forward to it as well. Thanks, guys. Anything left that uh, you want to make sure you, you impart before we... I would just leave? love to be here with you every morning. It would be a delight. It would be fun. She's Jamie Ivey. Stay tuned. Back tomorrow morning, starting at 5 a.m. here on KVA. Stop outside of it's a wrap. Also, let's not well, you can say bye. Oh, bye. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>